Oh, I'm like kind of wrapped in this cable a little bit. All right, we good? Oh, are we good? Yeah, we're good now. All right. All right. Breach and Nexic. We just saw this. Nexic destroyed him in the crew battle. Oh, yeah, uh, I saw that. Um, fun Poor fact, Nick is injured AF today. So he tore, uh, tore something in his leg yesterday. So, like, but he showed up for the crew. Shout out to Nick. I was gonna say, like, if he entered his hand, like, he's a man for like trying. He not not only enter, not only entering the crew battle, entering the actual bracket, like, while here with an injured, with an injury. Like, what did he injured? Uh, the back of his legs. So it doesn't affect his play, but like he was like walking around apparently like hurts. So. Oh, okay. Uh, but uh, we're seeing more of uh, Max seems pretty good this matchup. Uh, in the past he lost to Magic Cube like before Magic Cube was good, but due to that he like learned a lot I think and kind of got better. Oh, okay. Um. And yeah, we're seeing that right now. Breach is having a really hard time getting in. That's kind of the thing about this matchup. Like, Peach gets in hard, but Falco is like a, a brick wall to get through. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, look at that. And plus, Peach is like so floaty that yeah, you can Falco do the... is just like shine all the way up to stage. Yeah, giant shine off the top is a bit, definitely in play in this matchup. Uh, it's another quick stock for Nexic. Man, not, Nexic is just killing him. Yeah, I think he's just keyed into. I think he knows like what Nick wants like for his openings. Like, so he's like just playing against like what Nick is like doing. He's like, he, Nick's not surprising him right now, you know. Yeah. Uh, Nick really needs a grab. All right. Oh, there's. Well, I mean, I, w I would I would hope for up throw, but like that's cool too, I guess. He really wants to get into that uh, that down. Yeah, like that. Right. But he know. But Nick knows that what he's do planning to do. Yeah. Oh, that was in there. That was an air and a half. Or even, maybe even back air would have been better because lasting hitbox or whatever, but yeah, that was back yeah. air or an air. Okay. Let's see if, uh, let's see if Breachin can get, get his opening he needs. Uh, I mean, it's a little early to start talking about next game, but like, I think Breachin would benefit from less space, honestly. I feel like, um, or maybe not even less space, maybe like, maybe just, I think maybe a, like FD or FOD are like his only options, really, because the platforms just seem to be like, oh, yeah. where like, he's going to mess it up. Mexic is like, Oh, he counts on those platforms. Yeah, he does. All right. Oh, okay. So Breach gets a stock. Um, yeah, he missed the. He got battlefield basically. Got battlefielded. Okay, yeah. I'm down. Uh, I mean, this is like the thing about Peach Falco is that this matchup is stupid, right? Like this, like Falco is a character that, like, when he's off stage at any percent, might just die. Yeah, uh, like his recovery just sucks compared to like most characters. Yeah. yeah. And Peach is a character who like takes advantage of that almost harder than anybody. It's like Peach and Marth is like the best edge guarders in the game, I would say. Um, I would say Jigglypuff is one of them too. Jigglypuff, yeah, but like with Jigglypuff, you have to kind of go out there. Like Mar like Peach and Marth can kind of just sit the ledge and cover everything, you know. Yeah. yeah. But what like, about, what about Sheik? Sheik too, but Sheik's like little. Sheik's weird too. Sheik requires like you can't doesn't have very much multiple option coverage. Like you can cover one thing with an air, cover one thing with back air. Couple, cover a couple things with down smash, but yeah. Um, take him, all right, take him up to Dreamland. Or found a dreams. This is a, this makes sense to me. Oh, uh, Dreamland, my bad. Yeah, yeah. They, this, they have the word dream in it, so. Th this makes sense to me uh, because like when the platforms are down, he'll be able to get really really long combos on Nexic if he's oh, yeah. if he's playing well. And the platform heights will mess up Falco more than the mess up a Peach player. Oh yeah, like I count on pla like as a Ganon main, I count on I really need platforms, and it just kind of messes up with me. Yeah, yeah. Like for, for the platforms moving up and down. Yeah, yeah, for sure. On stream? Yeah. All right, sweet. Uh, man, we just, we're not seeing, like, really strong punishes. That's, like, all it is. Like, he's getting him off stage every once in a while. He's getting his grab. But he's not, like, finishing the kill, and he's not getting, like, extra percent, really. He's missing those opportunities. Ooh. Ooh, text that. Yeah. Didn't even need to, but text it anyways. I honestly, that tech almost screwed him over, because he could have, he should have just, like, you know, just just jumped after oh, the headstone yeah. was over. But, like, uh, he probably passed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that was unnecessary. We've seen some unnecessary stuff from Breachin today, though. We saw the Waveland fair in the crew battle. <laughs> that was actually sick. It was sick, but it was completely unnecessary. Yeah. Um. All right, dash deck. Once again, opportunity. That's good. A good one. That's a good one. Yep. All right, this is uh, one stock deficit is not once again not bad in the Falco matchup. Uh, you can easily get a stock off this character, especially if they jump into your down smash on platforms like oh, a yeah. scrub. Uh, <laughs> Gotta hit that. One. <laughs> it's so it's good. It's so stupid. It's, it's so especially, good. Especially in team battles where they just spam it. It's like a blender. It is like a blender. Like, and oh I, I like I like that like I feel like it's so good in like casual play too. Like how did it get through like play testing? Like, oh yeah, this is fine. Like, yeah. This looks good. Oh, let's make it up to like zero to like fifty or sixty percent. Let's do that. That seems fair. They, they must have thought Peach was like really weak or something. Like they must yeah. have thought she needed it. But like I can't I can't imagine how her moves are so strong. Yeah. Alright. Uh Peach with no ledge options really to cover that. Behind. Uh, behind the uh, laptop. Chris. Okay, whatever. Here. Ooh. Okay. Oh, 
Okay, well, he, uh, he'll figure it out, hopefully. Okay. Uh, anyways, edge guard situation. I would have, like, yeah. down air there. Down air to cover, like, below the ledge, uh, Firefox. Because uh, you can't sweet spot it very well from that angle. You have to ride the wall. So, um... Man, Nexus just winning neutral. It's, it's, coming down, it's not even coming down to punish game or anything like that. Nexus just beating him in neutral, like, over and over and over yeah. again. Uh, but Breach would have to, like, counter that by either, like, winning neutral more himself or, like, you know, punishing super hard. Uh, but, like, it's hard to just, like, just, like, start winning neutral more against someone who's beating you in neutral. Like, you have to start playing, like, totally different. And, like, oh, different well. <laughs> That's it. Rip. Alright. We're at Hunt for his Crypt next on the stream. Let me see if All I can right. get some more commentary. See you, stream. Do you want to commentate your voice?